Hey, what's up guys? Nick White here doing tech and coding stuff on Twitch and YouTube. Check the description. I have premium problems on Patreon. You got to check that out and uh, join my Discord. Thank you. This is an easy problem we're warming up on the day. It is called smallest range I. Uh, given a, a lot of dislikes. Wow, I didn't even notice that. Given an array A of integers, and for each integer A of I, we may choose any X with negative K, where X is greater than or equal to negative K, and add X and less than or equal to k, and add x to a of i. Okay, so we're going to get an array of integers and an integer k. So an array of integers and a value k. So we could get some numbers like 1 through 6 and a value k. We can add or subtract any number between 3 and negative 3 in this case, but k and negative k to any number. Okay, so for example, 1, we could add 3 or we could subtract 3. I think we can also add 2, subtract 2, whatever, in, as long as it's in between k and negative k. After this process, we'll have some array b. Okay, great. Um, return the smallest possible difference between the max val of b and the minimum value of b. So the smallest difference between the max of b and the min of b. Um, this question is kind of weird. I think I see the dislike. It's like... It seems like almost they give you this information to throw you off a little bit that you could change any number um, or each integer. Uh, it should just be, I mean, I think the wording is a little bit weird to trick you. It's kind of like, it's kind of like, what are you doing? Like this isn't, explain the problem correctly. It's a really easy problem if you explain, explain it to correct, correctly. They're just saying things to confuse you kind of. And uh, I think a lot of interviews don't really do this anymore. It's kind of counterproductive. Google doesn't even give uh, brain teasers anymore, really. So um, what they want is just the minimum. Th you can add or subtract K. So the lowest value, the minimum difference between the lowest value and the maximum value is we just take the max value there's nothing going to be lower than the lowest value and there's nothing going to be greater than the maximum value so we just need to find the smallest value like one and the largest value six and we just decrease the largest value by k and we increase the smallest value by k so we just add three and we subtract three and then you know we're left with zero distance because it's going to be exactly what we want you know so um, that's pretty much it. I mean, in this case, right? Zero, we can add two. Zero plus two is two. Ten minus two is eight. So two to eight is six. Um, this is uh, zero instead of negative one because we're not doing negative distances. It's just zero distance if it, uh, if it goes from one to, um, you know, four and then six goes to three. Like, we're not, it just goes to zero distance. We don't want to go negative. Okay, so... Easiest problem ever. Weird wording on the question, but all right, let's set up our minimum. So we will get um, int min val equal, we'll just set it to the first element. Int max val is equal to the first element as well. And then we'll just loop through the array. I less than a dot length i plus plus. Um, min val equals i'm sure you guys are um familiar with minimums min val is equal to math dot min of the current min val and a of i max val is similar it's just going to be the maximum of max val in a of i once you have the maximum and the minimum there's two options right we have um min val if min val plus k is greater or equal to max val minus k well then that means there's going to be a zero distance return zero like in that example where this goes to you know four and then this one can go down to three we would just set this one to three because it would we want all threes so um we want them to be equal so it's going to be zero so else we just return um, max val, you do max val because it's bigger, minus k, minus, we know it's bigger than uh, min val minus k, I mean min val plus k,
because we check right in this example if minval is not greater than or minval plus k is not greater than or equal to maxval minus k this one's greater so we'll subtract minval plus k from maxval minus k that's it i mean boom boom like i said like i said boom except for when you mess up but shouldn't say boom unless you're certain that you're right and clearly we're not right here um uppercase k i suck guys how many errors do i make someone start keeping a tally there we go that's it i mean there you go it's a simple solution there's no space it's just a linear scan through an array not a hard problem i'm not gonna dislike it i don't dislike problems but like i don't know the this description kind of sucks but let me know what you guys think let me know if you have any questions pretty easy see you in the next one peace